first of all. All right, why are you so close? <laughs> Anyways, guys, this is a tri another trip. We're going to Nibantan. Nibantan to her grandmother's house. Bring us a few supplies, some things. Her, her grandmother needs. She's 87 years old. And having some difficult. Just as mom is there now, taking care of her mother. But uh, that's what's going on today, guys. Thanks for stopping by. Hello, guys. This is Glenn, just going in the Philippines. This video is about uh, helping out my wife's grandmother a little bit for a little supplies and bread, fruit and stuff like that, some biscuits, uh, just for her. She lives with her son, and it's not too far from here, maybe a 40 minute drive. Of course you have to walk down through the path to get to uh, where she lives. But um, it's upsetting. People are finding out are pretty much the same all over the world, good or bad, or her uh, immediate family that live there aren't really helping her. She lives in this little part of the house. You'll see the video. Um, my mother-in-law is there helping because her brother is just there wasn't much help. They treat her like she don't exist. When you get older, you know, those people, your grandparents or your mother, they, they changed your dirty diaper, so you should be here to help, man. I don't say too much or waste my opinion because I'm just visiting. I'm a visitor here, so I know my boundaries just gets upset when, you know. And then them saying that, oh, well, she's too weak to go for a checkup to the hospital. There's a bunch of men there. Pick her up. Put her on the tuk-tuk, the jeepney, whatever. And she's worried about money. She told my wife, well, there's a free clinic. You get the medicine and everything for free. The woman's 87 years old. But um, she needs to, she needs people's help at the moment. And I just wanted to say this before you see the video. You'll see where she lives. and Not much of her living arrangement, but she has no fan. She has one little light. And this is not how it's supposed to be when you get older. The same thing goes on in America. But... Um, do as much as you can you you know when you're here you can't help everyone you give a few coins and do what you got to do but you know yeah. if you're on a fixed income and you don't have money or a big pension or nothing you will go broke quick there's nothing wrong with helping people on wall for it like the video that i posted helping the lady who walked for, from three in the morning to like 11 she got down from the mountain so in calabasa for 30 pesos and some of the people here tried to get it for 20 pesos, seriously. I only got like 19 views on that. And it was about helping somebody. So that tells you how this goes with the uh, your video being shared. But anyways, I've been praying for Grandma. And hopefully they will get her out to, uh, to the clinic to get a checkup. She probably needs medicine. She, she needs to be able to walk around. They don't, they don't even, they don't do that for her. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching our channel. And uh, keep us in prayer for a safe trip back to the States. See you on the next video. <laughs> Hello. 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 Welcome to my Bantan. We're visiting my wife's grandma. Bring some supplies. Yeah, we have some apples. Where's Show you guys. Oh. We have some bread, um, crackers, apple, and some coffee and bread. We're bring you. Corn coffee. I've never heard of that. Apparently, there's no caffeine in it. it does me no good. Oh. Tripping over everything. No, I can't drive the car down here, that's for sure.
Don't look at me like that, bro. <laughs> Tough situation here. That's her little room. She's 87. She deserves a little more than that. She has no fan or nothing. But anyways, we're visiting. Dropped off some food. Yeah. This is it. Province. Who died is 